Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to learn how to link OpenCV libraries to Qt. So with the help of this one, we are going to be able to use OpenCV libraries inside our Qt, also inside our projects based on Qt. So this is important. First of all, we need to create a project and uh, this is going to be C++ projects. The first one maybe we can call is OpenCV test. Sorry, OpenCV test by CMake. First of all, maybe we can start. So the next one. So also Qt is now suggesting the CMake, but uh, previously they, it was always suggesting the QMake firstly. So it's also changing its backend based on CMake, I believe. They are saying like that. I read some of articles uh, in that way. So we can also make CMake. Also, I'm going to show how to link with QMake. And next, we can choose this 6.5 GCC. And next, um, okay, we can say finish. So it came uh, a simple hello world example. So we can try our uh, one of the OpenCV header including, uh, for example, OpenCV2. Maybe I can make a little bigger. And high UI, which is one of the famous header. And we can try to use it, but uh, it's going to give error, of course, because it cannot find OpenCV if it, even it is installed in our Ubuntu environment. So what we need to do is just linking inside this CMake. Uh, how we are going to do that? There is already an example in OpenCV documentation. It's already saying us which one. Just I need these two lines, so it's going to be able to find OpenCV libraries. OK, and we just need to make this one. And after that, uh, I believe it's gonna find just clear CMake and run CMake again. So now it's already able to find high GUI. So it's not gonna complain anymore. So it's working fine also. So also we will able to reach mat, cvmat or other kind of functions based inside this high GUI we can reach easily. Okay, so with the CMake we already learned how to link. Just simple, there are two lines we need to add. And it's done. Let's open one more project. And again, plain C++. And this one is going to be OpenCV test. And this is going to be QMake. Let's continue and choose QMake. Next, choose again the same GCC. Next, and finish. Uh, in this one, uh, we need to do little different one. For example, we need to add config. And the first one is going to be config. And here we are going to write link package config. But this is important if you, you need to install OpenCV according to the flex which I did in my previous video. This is important if you are not using package config flag is on. Maybe you are not going to be able to link in this way. This is, this is important. And then we need to also add package config. So in my case, I specified as OpenCV4. And yes. And after that, um, I can easily include. Let's still cannot see because it uh, didn't update according to the profile. But after that, we can refresh and it's going to find hiGUI.hpp. OK. So let's try to run directly. Maybe it will update. Yeah. So now it's able to find. Yeah. It's also the error is disappeared. And now we already learned how to link OpenCV with the CMake. Also with QMake. Just with the QMake one, you need to be careful. As I said, you need to install OpenCV according to the flag is on package config flag should be on in the CMake list. Yeah. Okay. Uh, for this video, I just wanted to show how to link OpenCV into the Qt with CMake and with the QMake. Okay, see you in the next videos.